Hi, this is Paul for Netbook News, and I'm here at the Apex Store Electronics booth, another Shenzhen tablet maker. And uh, I'm just going to turn it off because I want to show you the design, which is actually the, the, the really extraordinary thing with this tablet. If you look at the edges here, it kind of reminds me of what a Nokia Lumia tablet could look like. It feels extremely nice in the hand. It's a complete metal finish. Um, yeah, just take a look at this. I mean, it's, it's, it's a little on the thick side, but it, it feels nice still. It's, it's, it's heavy because it's really all aluminum, or all uh, metal at least. And uh, yeah, there's a bunch of ports, which Nokia probably won't implement. But if you look on this side, you see that there is uh, HDMI, two USB, one of them is host, uh, and micro SD. So that's pretty much all what you're gonna need. But now, if I turn it on, maybe you just saw it already. Yeah. <laughs> this is not your regular Android uh, lock screen. So if you unlock it, you get this weird iOS -y skin. It's terribly laggy. The, the specs aren't immensely impressive. If I take a look here, we've got uh, an Info T mic, one gigahertz ARM 11 CPU, 10.1 inch, uh, 1024 by 600, which is a little. Uh, I still, it's it's not my favorite resolution for 10 inch devices. It's just. And it's, it's super laggy. It's uh, half a gig of RAM uh, and then Wi-Fi. And it's, I think it's still running on Android 2.3. But they do want to update it, which is nice. Uh, prices are around the $100, 100 US dollar mark. So um, yeah, I can't even get out of here now. So it's, it's not great. But yeah, that's a Shenzhen tablet from the maker that is called Apex Electronics. That was Paul from Epic News from the Hong Kong Electronics Show. Thanks for watching.